Hey Slayers, hey Heartstoppers, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we're getting into episode 5, Winter. So excited. It's been a great season so far. I'm learning a lot about the Gen Zs, I guess. A couple reactions back, I said I'm going to be getting out of my head, and I absolutely am. I'm, fuck I'm completely over it. I'm gonna continue to be me as we know but i just like to shout out some idiot that actually commented such insensitive views and opinions like that's like a an oxymoron what is it called like they're my views and opinions so you calling them insensitive is your view and opinion where number one you obviously didn't watch the episode or my reaction because I continue to talk about it and say I'm learning and I'm here to understand how do people grow how do people learn new things you are an idiot forget insensitive forget whatever you're an idiot so everyone please watch your mouths in the comments with your short ass comments because you are a fucking clown. There's other reactions. You could go and enjoy them. Okay. For everyone else that's been enjoying my reactions, thank you so much. We know I keep it real on here. I'm not like a fucking snowflake. And yeah, that's period on that. So I'm excited. I think this is the Christmassy episode. I don't know if it's this one or the next one, but I think we're going to finally see, what's his name? Jonathan Bailey. Let me go to my notes. I will want to say, I can't believe you guys let the Agatha All Along reactions flop. I have decided to put that to an end and react to it on my own. But like, Charlie fucking Spring is in it. Like, I thought you guys would have cared about that. And not to mention is a 10 out of 10 11 out of 10 show i am excited to just watch it on my own and enjoy something for myself at the same time so sorry if anyone over here was enjoying them but i will no longer be reacting to agatha all along starring joe lock but yeah it's been honestly like two weeks since the last episodes i reacted to I obviously you know what the hell's going on you guys know what the hell is going on it's just i can't really recap it right now he went charlie went away but i believe he's back now i'm really excited to continue this journey moving forward i realized too i think we're gonna see nick's aunt like she might be hosting christmas or something like that i think that will be really cute i really want i want charlie to meet aunt diane and uncle rich i really do but yeah that's it if you like this video to help my reactions please give this a thumbs up it really helps me more than you know subscribe if you're new drop a comment and yeah if you'd like to watch the uncut reaction check out my patreon link will be below i also have a youtube membership for early edits and potential monthly lives to talk about the tv shows no one seems to care so let's move that along and get into the episode Going outside, oh it says sex in the corner what are you worried about today no thinking about what presents i'm gonna get oh is it christmas morning i hope i get a soul <laughs> i hope we get good mental health Word. i hope we get a mom who can regulate our emotions merry christmas merry christmas holiday season Henry is the cutest dog I've ever seen in my life and I need to meet him immediately. And you can come over and meet him at any time if you want. I know you've been stressed about today. Just... Aww. You're still looking a bit skinny, aren't you? I thought you were getting all that mess sorted out. They just don't get it. They're fine down there. I think she's just worried. Can't I just try and have a normal one? Just, just have fun. Oh, hey, brother. You know Dad's not coming. Maybe he will, maybe he won't. He won't. Stop acting like you know everything. Boyfriend became mentally deranged. You've been acting like you're the savior of the earth. Right? He wants attention. He stops eating. You have to be the hero who saves the day. Can you just shut the fuck up? Word. Great look, though. Was that the first F-bomb? We love it. Isaac, hey. Oh my god, how cozy. What do you think? I love these now lights. Now come and use those big, strong muscles to help me move the table. <laughs> She's so handsome, right? Is that fine? Oh, so insensitive, my bad. 
You're going to do wonderful things and make us all so proud. No, it is fine because non-binary, you could use any shit you want. Yes, my Addison Ray. Join the view. What if I was? Some might say you fancy me. What if I do? I love them. Someone gonna fucking walk in. Sorry, was that? Um, sorry. It's fine. Uh, Should we go for a walk? Yeah. Her makeup is slay. Did you meet anyone really crazy in there? You're not supposed to say that. We're just happy that Charlie's back to normal and back with us. We just need to get through the day. How about a snack? Snack on your mind? I don't want Can you stop pestering about food right now? Charlie, why don't we just go and play Mario Kart or something? You only managed half your dinner and, and the dietitian said that that's... You're not helping. Sorry, I even tried. <sighs> you guys all need to understand each other at the same time. This is her first time dealing with this too. Please don't. I just can't deal with all of that. Tori, you should come. Can't you at least spend Christmas with me? Oh. You spend all your time with Nick anyway. Because he treats me as something Relatable. other than mentally ill. I do too. Sorry. Well, I'll see you later. That's... That hurts. Where's your coat? I cut all the bruises. Uh, this is the boyfriend then. Oh my god. <laughs> That's kind of He's coming lot. in. We don't bite. Promise. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was cute. Can you turn around while I change? Oh, uh, yeah, of course. These kiddos, like... Can you also dry your hair? Come on. Merry Christmas. It's really nice that Charlie's day really turned around, or Charlie's night, Christmas. I like kiss like that in so long. Yeah. Probably go back down now. Yeah. Ooh. Pointing that out is so funny, though. <laughs> we haven't kissed like that in so long. <gasps> Are you? Fucking kidding me? Guys, I react to Doctor Who on my channel. You can literally see my reaction to this episode. Oh my god. Whoa. This is so trippy. I guess that makes so much sense because Doctor Who is probably so popular in the UK. Wow. Did that just made me so happy. Dad, no, you know you got a real family who actually want to hang out with you. No, Dad is family. I think family are the people who actually give a shit. Merry Christmas. I feel like them two are gonna get together at some point, maybe. I'd be here for that. You left me to fend for myself against our cousins. Think Mum might be willing to apologise. Hate Christmas. Uh, you don't. I hate this one. I worry about you all the time. Just wish we could rewind and start today all over again. Well, it's always New Year's Eve. Huh? I'm not over Doctor Who. I'm sorry. Just it's just. It's, I'll do anything shocked. unless you also want to do things. I think about it. I also want to do things more complicated for me. Mm -hmm. I don't really think about you being trans, if that makes it easier. I know, but Ooh. I am trans, and it's a big part of me. Oh my god, I did not even think about the genitalia of this all. This is a lot. When you put your hand there, all my dysphoria just hit me. <laughs> Tao is so good, so perfect for her. There's no pressure. That was amazing. I'm sorry I made you feel like that. It's okay. End the night, right? Tori. Stop it! Oh, with the cousins, yay. Oh, adorable. I love New Year's Eve. I always say, like, there's not enough New Year's Eve in movies. It, or TV shows, it's usually because that's where like the hiatus comes in. 
Oh, this is fun. A friend's get-together, not like a parent's party. Love it. Love it. Kind of like the Halloween episode, but Charlie wasn't here, so. Whole new vibe. keeps going like viral. Yes, girl. I'm obsessed with Darcy's hair. And now it's coming out of your mouth. Don't look at me, please. Hey. Hey. You're right. How are you? I'm all right. Let's start. Let's do it. I love her coat. Imagine. <laughs> Poor girl. Yeah, I, you don't need to rush to come out as anything. Have fun with it. Yeah. yeah I will have fun with it. Do Thank you. you very much. Please have fun with it. Cheers. <laughs> Charlie, how come she rushed school for so long? Sorry, mate, we were actually just gonna go head outside. See you later. I feel like. I, I guess I can't speak from it or whatever, but who cares? That was a genuine questioning. I wish we didn't give a fuck what people think about. Hello. Just live your life. I mean, like, I definitely do, but I don't at the same time. It's very weird. Definitely do, but the reality of it is that I don't. It's just when I'm out in the wild, I suppose. I'm gonna get a drink. Hey. Oh, hey. Me and Tao, we want to have sex. Oh my god. No. Is it really that shocking? Don't seem that happy about that. I am. She's it's just a big nervous. deal. I mean, what if he touches me and, and I just freak out? If you're not ready, babe. Babes, we just take it slow. Really, really and want to. And you can to. stop at any I mean, second. And Tao does not care. Tao will do anything you that him. you say. Respectfully. Anything goes wrong, I'll be here for you, and he'll be there for you. I know he will. Thank you, girl. Almost midnight. Make sure you got someone to kiss. Fireworks. Fireworks. We haven't spoken properly since Halloween, and now you're here to kiss me at midnight. I'm not here for that. I wanted to apologize for Halloween. Okay. I wasn't doing it for attention or anything. I don't want to be just an experiment to you. Especially when you know you're the reason I realized I was buying in the first place. I didn't know that. I was gonna say, and neither did I. But I guess we all really didn't. Oh. Ooh, Tori. There you are. Where'd you go? Just her deal. need to get away from everything. I, uh, <laughs> don't worry. I'm not here to kiss you. I just don't want to be alone at midnight. <laughs> Ooh, Happy New Year. Happy New Year! Where, this is for real? I know what she was thinking. Okay, honestly, I'm not crazy about the Imogen thing. Give one straight storyline. It's a little, seems a bit a lot. Just every, well, it's happened in my life too. Everyone was turned to lesbian. But, um, I don't know. It just, it didn't feel, that didn't feel like a natural storyline. I don't know, like I could see that like not being in the books. But if it is, then I take it back. Okay, we're definitely moving forward with everything. I'm happy that Charlie went to Nick's and like had a good Christmas and it all wrapped up in a sweet little bow with the parents hugging each other at the end of the night when Nick Charlie went back home. Tori, I'm interested in her little storyline, lovey storyline. L and Tao. Seems like everything went well. I'm, I hope we get into the aftermath of that. Not like literally. <laughs> we need to know what's going on in Elle's head after that. I wonder who she'll talk to about it. Nick is perfect. I'm happy Charlie met at Diane. Thought that would have been more of a moment, honestly. I Oh, I just looked at the next episode. It says, 
terror suffers a panic attack. That's what Tara Jones was about. I didn't pick up on that at all, honestly. That makes sense. We didn't, like, explore that. Because she also doesn't seem... I guess that's kind of the point. Like, someone that would have a panic attack or, like, she doesn't seem like she has, like, social anxiety or anything. But I guess you don't need to. Interesting. All right, guys, let me know what you guys thought of this episode in the comments below. I always love reading and I respond to all of them, even the hateful ones. Yeah, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I will see you in the next one. It's Billy, bitch.